Here is a left rear shock that I removed yesterday. Let's do a push down test here and see how this responds. Now you're going all the way down and then you're releasing it. It should come up. And I'm, as I push down on it, I'm looking for any flat spots. This one feels pretty good. Look at that. If I actually get into it a little bit up and down, it's not feeling too bad at all. And you'd say, well, there's a little bit of dampness there, but that doesn't necessarily mean the shock is bad. And I think if you tested this with no comparison, you'd probably say, hey, I can use these shocks. They're fine, okay? Let's bring it up alongside the new rear one and do the same test side by side. Now, I know it's hard to tell in this video, but, you know, I'm having to push a little... <laughs> have to push a little bit harder on the left side we're gonna get them all the way down okay come on come on all right now i'm gonna release both look at how much faster the new shot came up so you see the subtle difference just a subtle difference between this new one and old one that will really affect the ride and handling of your car so just looking at shocks and feeling shocks doesn't necessarily mean they're okay